Hey all, hope you all are good. Today I am going to show how to connect MySQL with Talent. So first I will create a job. MySQL. Okay. We need to write purpose. Let's say MySQL. Write MySQL. Okay. I should provide a name. Okay. Then we will uh, use a MySQL input component from palette MySQL DB input. This is the component that we will use and we will set up a connection to it. So for that we will create a connection with the MySQL. So we will for right click on DB connect, uh, metadata. Here we will show DB connection and right click on create connection. Give a name to the connection. Let's say db db c o n n c t i o connection one. Okay. Uh, select the type of database. I'm going to use MySQL. Oh, default has been set to MySQL eight. You will give the MySQL password. Here it is encrypted. Here uh, as your MySQL is running locally, so we'll provide a local address. Local host address. Um, okay, I'm gonna use sample database. Here I've already created a database. Here you can see that here is a sample database. I'm gonna use it. We have, I'm gonna check. Uh, which tables are present in it using show tables command you can see emp table is present let's read its value okay you can see that there is id column mf name column present inside it you can even test the connection whether the connection is has been successful or not so you can see that the connection has been successful okay So we have created a metadata. First, we need to uh, double click on click in uh, on DB input to input its properties. I will select MySQL. I'm gonna use property type as repository, and we will provide the connection that we have created. So what it will do? It will autofill. It's all its rules. One two seven dot zero dot zero. Port number, sample, username, password, schema. But, uh, and we need to specify which table we want to use. We will write a query. Okay. Uh, I think this component has been completed. Now we will use a T log group component to print. print the table output, the query output on console. Uh, it will print in the form of table. We need to edit the schema. Okay. There are two columns basically ID. Its type is integer. Then comes uh, F name column. F name. Let me copy and its value is very care. Here also ID um, where care. Let's me change with the property again. So what it will do? It will read the input. Uh, this component T logro component will read the output of TDB output and here and it will act as an input to T logro and it will print the output with the same schema. Okay. Okay. Let me check again. Okay, it's correct. Now let's run this job. Okay, you can see that uh, the connection has been successfully established. It has read three rows in one. 0.97 seconds and here it is output let insert one more row 
uh, insert into emp values uh, example 4 mm, let me give its values to Sanjay ok so I have inserted one row successfully let's run it again ok so here you can see that one more row has been inserted and it is saying that it has read four rows successfully in one nine or uh, one point eight four second so thank you hope you enjoyed this video.